number 13, let f be the function defined by f of x equals x cubed plus x. If g of x equals f inverse of x and g of two equals one, what is the value of g prime of two? So this g of two equals one also tells us because g is f inverse, this also means that f inverse of two equals one because g and f inverse are equal. Those are the same thing. So to go about finding g prime of two, we first need to just take g prime of x. So if we take the derivative of g to get g prime, the derivative of f inverse would be f inverse prime of x. We have a formula for this. It is one over f prime of f inverse of x. So if we plug in what we know, we don't know f prime yet, but we do know we're looking for f inverse of two because we're looking for g prime of two. Okay, f inverse of two is one. So we need to know f prime of one. So let's take the derivative of f of x to get three x squared plus one. And let's find f prime of one by plugging one in for x. One squared is one times three is three plus one is four. So f prime of one is four. And our answer is one over four.